Welcome back to the next to the next video of me, Wizard 100, playing Donkey Kong Country 3, Dixie Kong's Double Trouble. Last time we got a banana bird, cleared two levels, which was not very impressive, but we're gonna go to title trouble. Let's see what's tr what trouble we have at the title area. Are we all ready? Oh, well, that's nice of the game. We already can find the DK coin right now. The way the, the the way Fatty McFat Fat carries the barrel is kind of funny. Oh wait, there's another thing. I guess that's how much you can say I don't remember much of this game because I don't even remember this uh, the baby's uh, name. Yeah, that's kind of cool. You get to put the barrels in the water, using it as platforms to stand. <laughs> You bees have the same bee sounds as the other bees, but not really. Clownfish. Oh, I get it now. I was like, those fish always looked so weird. I don't know why. And that is just scary as all hell, I have to say. as a, Like, as a kid, scary as all hell. It's just like, this barrel with a face and then it waves its arms like, Wooga, 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 wooga. Like the Tasmanian devil or something. And here's On Guard, who manages to... Who manages to stay through pretty much all the games on Super Nintendo. He's still got the special abilities. Now let's see. I think him and Expresso were the only ones. Oh, there's a new enemy right here. This clam with uh, thinking about Bob Spikes for heads. And a reward. A bundle of bananas. It's summer, by the way, so if you have any bananas, be sure to eat them. Oh yeah, that's right. You can you can skip on the water. I forgot about that. You know, I figured that I'd fail with Fatty McFatFat here, but, you know... There was a barrel nearby, so I wasn't too worried about it. Of course, that's why I never really liked the baby, because he's heavy. He's heavy! And usually, you'd kind of like a... would want a heavy baby. Because that's a sign that it's healthy. Okay, okay, going up is, uh, what I want. So I can hit this bird! Ain't that a bitch. Oh, you son of a... Oh, no! Urgh. That's annoying. I'll have to off-screen this. Unless I can... kill myself some way. Uh, you know what? I'll just off-screen that. But basically, you'd have to bounce up, and that's where you would kind of learn how to do that. Or figure to do that. Ooga, ooga, ooga. Hmm. This inconspicuous crack in the floor. Oh, I should probably throw this thing away. Wait, wait, wait. What am I doing? This is what you're supposed to do. This is what you're supposed to do. And a failed flag. I'll off-screen that. At least I'll know, like, what levels I need to go back to do. Skidda's Row. Skid ass row. Skid ass row. Already a snow level? A very mystical snow level theme. I'm about to fall off. This guy always made me laugh in a, in a way because he just looks so silly. Running back and forth on a roof. Now, what the hell is. Now, what, what what's this? Like, really? It just looks weird. Like, as an enemy. An ice lodge. I could have sworn I just saw something down there. And I did not expect to go there. Actually, speaking of which... Nope, he can't do the dot DK slap. Bash the baddies. 
Oh, he kicked him in the eye. Fatty McFat Fat. Oh, he got hit in the face. We're going to try that again, and since it's not too much of a backtracking. Can't believe I failed that. It's all. I can't believe I failed that again! It's not that hard, I'm just rushing through it. Uh, come on. Geez, you can't even ask the thing to, like, do what you expect. See? That's all I had to do. No need to rush it. Although, not wasting you guys' time is, uh... Pretty good proposition, I'd like to think. Hey, was there something here? No. I still prefer, like, uh, Donkey Kong Country 1's, uh, Snow World. Now that was some... Now that was some dread. Like, the first time you go to the Ice World... Always kinda... Pardon the pun, gave me a sh uh, cold shiver down my spine. Especially when you didn't save. Find the coin. Damn it. Well, let's get to try again, depending on situation. Let's take our time. We're not going to have a whole entire video where I'm just all about son of a bitch. Hang on a second, I'll be right back. Well, scene splicing effects. Right here, right now. Because the phone rang. Hate him. Hate them all. Can't, can't do a video without getting interrupted. But I guess I'll just have to splice this scene in. That was, that clip was about, that, that, that ha first half of the video was about seven minutes long. Seven minutes or so long. Anything over here? Did we get everything? Oh yeah! Oh right, right, right. That's where I need to backtrack. Murky Mill. Is this the really dark one, or? Yeah, it's a dark one. Elevator action. Oh yeah, this is where you become. Is this the one where you have to run away from mice when you turn into literally the animal? Uh, some of them have certain weaknesses, like um. Dumbo here. Yeah, let's just call him that. If he sees a rat in the light, he will actually uh, be very terrified. But outside of that, he, he can step on them. So, there's a little bit of puzzles uh, solving here. I'll, I'll demonstrate right here. Because you know elephants are afraid of rats and mice, which is actually not true. But hey, it's what the cartoon said, right? So it must be true. Gotta kill that rat. Probably has something good. That he's hiding from me. But man, Dumble has a really strong nose to carry a barrel like that. Oh, it's just a life. Who needs to get a life? <laughs> chuckle, chuckle. Okay, gotta get him close and... Apparently that won't work. So I'll we'll have to go get a get that barrel. Well, that was a waste of a uh, Dumbo. Ah, oh, Dumbo, that movie. Ah, uh, a sweet little movie. And then of course the pink elephants when he gets drunk, which I never understood for the longest time until I got much older. You know, because it's Disney. At least you made it to a checkpoint. I was wondering if I could jump on them or not. And the answer is no. I was thinking of Rambi. Rambi was the one that was able to jump. Rambi was the one that was able to jump onto him and actually hurt them. Come on, Dumbo. Bam. 
I don't know why I had to make all those noises, but hey, it works. I mean, he died. Or, he was knocked out. Hmm, I'll keep these steel barrels. Oh, and then there's another one. Oh, another... Most of these DK coin puzzles are just just revolves around that. Not not too complex, but at least it makes you... You know, I can't even say if it makes you think, because it's pretty straightforward. Oh, man. Now that is one tough Red B. Red B! Oh, yeah, I was in a podcast with... The, with uh, my site members at River City Gamers, and apparently there's this game called B... Beaker? Yeah, Beaker, where apparently uh, this generation of gaming, all the all the players, they don't know how to play video games. Apparently that game went through so many changes to, to dumb it down for people that play it because they're dying so many times at it. It's, you know, I'm not surprised, but it is still kind of a sad thing to think about, like, with the way gaming has treated a uh, treated like the, the kids of this generation and such but then again like like we talked about in the in the podcast circumstances like hey if you're given easy games to play and never played a hard game then you'll never get good as a video gamer right so it's kind of hard to like somewhat hard to blame them for it but at the same time, they don't really have much of an excuse. I mean, back then, when you were given a hard game, you, you either got good at it, or you just... You were either good, or you just sucked ass at it. Oh, it looks like I'll need to go back and get some more barrels. This red bee looks like an angry video game reviewer. Better be careful, because barrels won't even stop. I think explosives would, though. So. Still had to get another one. Ha. Come on, absorb. Damn it. Stupid angry bee. Angry bees. At least it's not an angry bird. Alright, that should be everything. Yeah, we got everything. Well, I'm not going to go through the next level, but I will show you Swanky's uh, Slideshow, which is which is a fun game, I must say. I played it a lot. Well, would you, love it? would you believe it? Hello, Kongs. Welcome to my all-new bonus tent. My show's on the road, and it's in every land. The cost of this game? Two coins in the hand. There are some great prizes on offer today, so come on in and choose to play. Just do that, and you'll... What? And you're right away. So come on, Kongs, and have a go. You could win well. You never know. Oh, it'll be pretty easy. Okay, Kong, it's your choice today. Which game would you like to play? Race, Endurance? I think head-to-head. -head. Today's contest is a throwing game with differences. The happy player goes. Oh, so you've reached the bonus game then, have you? It's not a simple game of questions and answers this time, though, from Donkey Kong Country 2. Now, have you got to beat yours truly if you want to win any prizes? Three, two, one, go. Yeah, basically we, we have to throw stuff at uh at the board and try to get all the way to get all the way to our, our icon even though I'm cranking just one. Get out of my tent now, you cheeky ape. Wait till I tell your parents. Alright, what do we get? Coins and bananas. Bananas, you were great. I hope you'll be back again. Then the prize will be bigger than and better. Let's play that again since we still have time. And get some coins while I'm at it. Endurance. Race to 25. Today's round is special. The one game where the winners is the first to score 25 points. At last, I'm out of retirement. Now they make a monkey out of you. Three, two, one. Of course, Cranky has to kind of screw up for us to win. Although I am slightly worried, though. But this is only the start. And this doesn't end as fast as head-to-head, -head from uh, what I've seen. 
You press any button, as long as long as it hits the crocodile, you're okay. You don't have to hit it directly on, so... You didn't have to be perfect, which is fine. Dude. You know, if you actually lost to Cranky Kong, then... Somewhat questionable. I mean, he's an old man. Or an old ape. Alright, just two more. And even if time runs out, whoever has the most wins. Oh, so you managed a fluke victory, huh? I'd like to see you try again. In the future, Cranky. In the future. Bananas, bananas, let's have a big round of applause for our contestants! This is pretty much how you get all, most of the coins. And hey, it is kind of fun. If a little repetitive, but that will be it for now on this episode of Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 3. Dicks, er, Double Trouble with WizWar 100. <laughs> You're the viewers and I'm the Let's Player. So see you next time.